bizarre interesting tech on crowdfunding platforms massive Bluetti 5100 watt hours UPS. I'll admit that I came across this almost immediately after the Duex dual screen laptop monitors yesterday, but had to do a double take after glancing at this thing which took a day. Having just moved across multiple oceans. Yours truly was in the mood for UPS for the review test setup and this got my interest in more ways than one. Bluetti had launched a 2000 watt hours energy storage device last summer, which was pretty good timing for all the work at home and energy shortage experiences shortly across the globe, and the company clearly saw a need to go even bigger. This time, they have up to a 5100 watt hours portable UPS slash battery that can be charged by AC mains or even solar power. The portability comes in the form of a fairly compact and energy dense device on wheels, with the intention being to roll this over to wherever you want. The increased energy density relative to a typical UPS is indeed with a lithium ion battery, but one that uses LFP, lithium iron phosphate, chemistry instead. LFP chemistry, for those interested, is relatively new to the battery market owing to challenges until recently in increasing the electrical conductivity, but offers advantages over most other options in not using nickel or cobalt, thus making it more eco-friendly, safer, and less costly, while retaining increased charge, discharge cycles at a usable efficiency. Indeed. The Blue Eddy P500 proclaims 6,000 cycles of use at retaining 70 to 80 percent capacity at this point, which alone means you can run a small house for 15 plus years should you find the means to charge it consistently too. The company is providing the means to hook it up to solar charging kits, as well as a fusion panel for 240V operation from the 120V units to run high power machinery. Yes. It's complete overkill for my needs and yours, and at $27.99 plus on Kickstarter for the SKUs it is priced out for many DIYers too, but it's still interesting tech from a materials and engineering perspective that perhaps may interest some homeowners here. Apparently others agreed with this already, seeing as how it met its goals within 24 hours and has a little under 2 months left to go to break some crowdfunding records. Hit the link in the source for more info if you are interested.